Young Madam Olivia, please wake up. Your mom is getting angry. Can you leave my room, Amelia? But your mom told me to wake you up. She might get angry if she saw that you're still not awake. Olivia, it's enough. Get up right now and get ready for your flight. But mom, I don't want to go to that stupid city. You have to go there at any cost. Why, mother? Why can't I stay here and complete my studies? Because everyone in our family completes their higher education abroad. Now get up right now. I don't want to hear any of your lame excuses. Ugh! And yes, make sure you do not make such kind of stupid drama in front of your father. We are waiting for you at the breakfast table. Ugh! Why me? Hello? Hi, Olivia. Are you ready for the flight? No, not yet. But, don't worry! I'll be ready in five minutes. But that's impossible! Come on, Olivia! We will be late for our flight! Get ready quickly! Now! Okay, fine! Relax! I'll see you in a bit. Yeah, okay, bye! Oh no! How am I going to get ready in just five minutes? <sighs> Calm down, Olivia. Everything will be fine. Just take a deep breath. How is your sleep? It was fine, Dad. Thanks for asking. Are you excited to go to the new city? Uh... Oh, yeah, Father. I'm... Uh, I'm excited. Glad to hear that, sweetie. Oh, yeah? Okay, I'm coming. Okay, Mom and Dad. I'm getting late. I'll be going now. Have you packed everything for the flight? Yeah, mother. See you guys. Finally, you're here. Let's go now. Mia, are you really excited to go there? Well, it's about studies. Otherwise, I don't want to leave this place. Yeah, me too. I told mom that I don't want to go. Let's just go, Olivia. Maybe the new city will not be that bad. After all, people say it's a wonderful place for a visit, and we're going to study there. Maybe, but I'm happy that we're both going together. Otherwise, it will be so hard to make new friends there. Let's go! We keep talking! Did you take sweater and jacket? Of course. Mother said that it is so cold there. Yeah, unless, like our city, it's always so hot. I agree. Wow! It's so big, Olivia! Oh, yeah. It's such a big school. I'm afraid. What if we get lost here? Don't worry, we'll stay together. We need to find the principal. I'll ask that girl over there. Hey, excuse me. Yes? Can you help us? We need to meet the principal. Do you know what a principal's office is? Yes, take a left and right. Okay, got it. Thanks. Let's go. Can we come in, sir? Of course. You must be the new students, am I correct? Yes, we are the new students here. It's so nice to meet. Let's give you a quick tour first. That was a very nice tour. Thank you, sir. No problem, girls. 
I hope that this school is just right for you. Um, sir, can you tell us about dorms? Oh, yes. Thanks for reminding me. You'll both be staying in one dorm. If you have any problems or have any kind of issues, you can always contact me. Okay, thanks. That was so kind of him, right? Yeah... right. Um, Olivia, what are you thinking? Um, nothing, Mia. It's just... the school seems... old, doesn't it? Hmm, yeah, it does. But what's wrong with that? No, nothing is wrong. Let's get to the dorms. We have to unpack stuff. Whoa, whoa, whoa! This place is so cool! I'm starving. Is there something to eat? Maybe there's a canteen downstairs? Uh, but I'm not sure if we're allowed to go there at this hour. But remember what Sir said? We're hungry. We need food. So what? Uh... Let's go. That was some good food, wasn't it? Mm-hmm. Hey! Nobody's here at this hour except for us. But... who's that guy? Uh, I don't know. Maybe he got a punishment? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> well, let's head safely arrived. Yes, Mia is with me too. Uh, tomorrow is cold day. Olivia! Wake up! It's time for school! At least don't shout! What do you mean? We already missed breakfast! It's time for first class! Hurry up! What? Oh my god! Didn't you put the alarm on? Oops! Oh, come on! Now what are you waiting for? Let's go! Uh, yeah, give me five minutes! Ugh, seriously? Okay, I'm done! Let's go! Do you even know which is our first class? We'll ask somebody! Let's go! I think everyone left for class! Hey! I see a guy over there. I'll go ask him. Okay, I will wait here for you. Hello. Excuse me? Um, excuse me. Can you help me? Hey, wait! What happened? What did he say? It was the guy we saw yesterday sitting on the stairs. He didn't answer me and walked away. That's kind of weird. Let's just go to Mr. Principal. Thank you for giving us class schedules. No problem. Um, sir, I have a question. Um, there's a guy in the school and he wears black mask. He was studying late at night on the stairs. On the stairs? Yeah. You may have some misunderstanding, Olivia. There's no guy in our school who wears a black mask. Plus, black masks aren't even allowed on campus. Only a surgical mask is allowed. Uh, sir, can we go now? We have our next class soon. Sure, girls. Have fun in your first class. Why did you stop the conversation? Are you dumb? Why are you thinking about that guy so much? Um, I don't know. But he seems suspicious to me. Come on, Olivia. We're here to study, not to investigate. Maybe he has some problem with his skin. That's why he wears that mask. Oh, yeah. I didn't think about that. You're crazy. Let's go. It's our very first class. Welcome, students. My name's Miss Scarlet, and I will be your homeroom teacher. So for today's lesson, I want you all to be active and pray before we start today's lesson. Oh, I'm so sleepy. I need some coffee. Olivia, what are you doing? Wake up! Oh yeah, I'm up! Okay class, that's it for today's lesson. Class dismissed! Today was an amazing day! You know what? 
Uh, I thought we were supposed to study here, right? Girl, I didn't mean that. That dude was really handsome. Not gonna lie. Okay, so what? What do you mean by that? Don't you like handsome boys? Uh, what kind of question is that? Looks are not everything. Whoa, you sound like an old woman. Focus on your studies, Mia. Oh, and what about that black mask dude? Did you see him again? To be honest, yeah, I did. I don't know why he seems so different from the other guys. Well, if you like him, then he's very lucky. Hold on. First of all, I don't like him. And plus, I don't even know his name. It's called love at first sight, girl. You know what? I'm gonna go to sleep. Good night. Hey, who's going to wash the dishes then? Do it by yourself. Fine, but tomorrow you will do it.